get you, Brit! Yeah, right! <laughs> Try to catch me first! Ugh, I hate those kids! I can't take it anymore! It's time for a big change around here! <laughs> I knew you couldn't catch me! Oh, yeah? Well, how about I throw you in the pool? What? No, no, no! Don't throw me in the pool! Oh, come on! Get over here! Nope! No way! This is base! Girls! Oh, hey, Mom! What's up? I have something I want to show you! Tell the living room right now! Oh, my gosh! Guys, maybe it's a puppy! I'm so excited! Come on, come on! Let's go! Oh! Um, what's this? Yeah, Mom, what's going on? Well, I can't stand you girls, so I've decided it's time for some rules. Rules? Yeah, Mom, come on. We already have, like, a million of those. I don't care. If you don't follow these rules, you'll be in huge trouble. Now, I'm gonna let you study the rules. Don't you dare break them. Got it? Yeah. Okay, Mom. Is it just me, or is this crazy? Yeah, what the heck? Okay, what even are these rules? Rule number one, no loud noises, no complaining, no excessive fun, no messes allowed ever, no stinking, no laughing. Oh my gosh, Brick, and no happiness? Breaking rules equals extreme consequences? What the heck? What are we supposed to do? I don't know, sis. I'm worried. We don't stand a chance. Do you really think Mom is serious? about this? I don't know. I mean, mom's always been really strict. Yeah, no kidding. She's literally the meanest mom ever. I don't know. I don't think she's that bad. Are you kidding me? Remember that time she canceled Christmas? Yeah, I mean, that was pretty mean. Do you think we should maybe try it out and break one of her rules? Absolutely not. I don't want to get in trouble. But Britt, it's the only way to find out. Okay, yeah, you're right. But honestly, I do not want to be the one who tests it out. Yeah, neither do I. There's gotta be something. Let me think. Oh, oh, I got it. What if we don't actually break the rules? What are you thinking of hiring like a body double or something? No, absolutely not. Brit, that's a crazy idea. Okay, then how the heck do you think we're gonna do this then? We need to invite over one of our friends to test it and they can break the rules. Oh, okay. I don't hate this idea, but um, I don't know any rule breakers. Do you? <laughs> of course we do. Oh, no, no, no. Are you gonna invite over your ex-boyfriend, Chuck? You bet I am. He's the toughest kid in school. Girls! There you are. What are you doing? Oh, uh, nothing, Mom. Just hanging out. Good. I wanted to make sure you weren't breaking any of my new rules. Us? No, of course not. Yeah, Mom. <laughs> not us. We'd never do that. Well, I thought I heard laughing. Uh... No, it was a sneeze. <laughs> No way would be laughing, right, Brett? Yeah, you're right. <laughs> Perfect. My rules are working. Now move it or lose it. Dinner's ready. Oh my gosh, I gotta go get Cammy. Okay, psst. hello. Open the door. Cammy, come on. Chuck's here. Ugh, what the heck? What are you doing? Hello, Cammy. Excuse me. Was that a loud noise? <laughs> Um, no, Mom, not a loud noise. That was a uh, dad. I think he's um doing something with the lawnmower outside, hit a rock. I don't know. Ugh, that idiot. I'm gonna go talk to him. Always ruining my everything. Whew. Okay, well, that was a close one. Cammy, your ex boyfriend's here. Come on, hurry up. Whatever, I'll go get the door myself. Y'all, yeah, what's up, Britt? Oh, hey, Chuck. Thanks for coming over. Yeah, no problem. Does Cammy want me back? Ugh, yeah, not again. Exactly. Oh, hey, Chuck. Cammy, what took you so long? I was fixing my hair, Brett. Leave me alone. How's it going? Thanks for coming over. Yeah, you know, anything to see you. You're awesome. Yeah, yeah, I know. Okay, Chuck, I have a mission for you. If I give you 50 bucks, will you break one of our mean mom's rules? Yeah, what do you say? Ha, rules? What are you talking about? Oh, come with me. I'll show you. These crazy rules, our mom came up with them. And if we break them, we're going to be in big trouble. <laughs> Wait a second. No laughing? No fun? Are you kidding me? <laughs> this is crazy. <laughs> what is someone breaking my rules? <laughs> oh my gosh, mom. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> these rules are whack. What the heck? No loud noises? This is crazy. Crazy? I'll show you crazy. Uh-oh. Get out of my house or I'll call the cops. Whoa, what the heck, lady? <laughs> Take that! Mom! Oh my gosh, what is going on? You can't be serious! Wanna bet you're insane! <laughs> Got him! Oh my goodness. So, uh, you weren't 
kidding about these rules, were you, Mom? Do I look like I'm kidding? <sighs> Good morning, world. That was a beautiful night's sleep if I do say so myself. Wait a second, what's that? Noise. It's a loud noise. <gasps> Mom's gonna freak. Where is it coming from? Kimmy, hey, what are you doing? But what's up, Brit? Whoa, okay. It's like someone starting their day with a dance party. You bet I am. Come on. This is my favorite song. Join me. Oh, this is a groove. Woo! <laughs> yeah. But seriously, sis, what are you doing? Mom's gonna lose her mind. Girl, I don't care. I'm just setting up the day with good vibes. But you don't want mom to hear you, do you? I don't care. Alexa, crank up the music. All right, well, hey, I'm gonna join you. Move over. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Woo! Woo! Alexa, turn off the music now! Hey, mom, come on. I was listening to that. Seriously? Uh, Kimmy, you might wanna be careful. Are you complaining? That's a Broken rule! Rule number two, no complaining! Okay, but mom, don't you think these rules are a little crazy? Rules are rules! Sorry, mom, I didn't mean to break your rules. Sorry, won't cut it. Pack your things, get out! Mom! Wait, you're kicking me out? You hard me! But mom! No more complaining! Mom, you can't be serious. Please, don't kick her out. It's too late. Come on, Cammy. You're coming with me. Mom, hey! What the heck? Mom, put me down! Ha! Hope you like living outside. Don't you come back in here! Wait, seriously? Hey, Cammy, I brought you some food. Thanks, Britt. I'm so hungry. I bet. I can't believe Mom actually kicked you out of the house. I can't either. I have to sleep out here? What if, like, a werewolf gets me? Or, or a spider? Or a snake? Britt, this is not the place for me. Girl, I know. Maybe we should talk to Mom. Yeah, good idea. But, um, I'm kind of banned from the house, so... Oh, no! Oh, that means I have to do it. Yep, sorry, sis. Oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. I really don't want to talk to Mom. I hate confrontation. Well, I hate sleeping outside, Brett. Come on, please help me. I just hope she can give you another chance. Girl, me too. I do not want to sleep outside again tonight. Brittany! Get inside now! Oh, gosh, okay. Um, wish me luck. Good luck. Hey, Mom. You, you screamed? You bet I did. What you think? I hung up signs of the rules everywhere in the house so that way you and your stupid sister would not forget them. Oh, wow. You really outdid yourself, Mom. Jeez. Thanks. There's copies above your bed, too. Gotcha. Hey, so actually, um, glad you called me in. I really want to talk to you. You know, Brittany, I have to say, I am so lucky at least one good child listens. Well, Mom, I have to ask, why did you make these rules up in the first place? Because you and your sister are annoying! I can't stand you! What? You can't be serious. I am serious, and don't you ask me questions! But Mom... Don't you remember rule number two? Don't forget it. No complaining! Okay, fine. But can you at least let Cammy come back inside? She could be eaten by a Yeti! No! Get lost! I have to go watch Grey's Anatomy! And I don't want you around ruining everything! Jeez Louise, mine. What has gotten into my mom? Oh, oh my gosh, she really wasn't kidding. <gasps> These rules are everywhere! Oh my gosh, there's like 14 rules above my bed! This woman has gone insane. Maybe my mom really is mean after all. Yeah, so if I just don't understand it. So, Bestie, what would you do in this situation? You know, I'm not too sure. My mom's normal. I like your mom. But there's gotta be a way to get my sister back in the house. I mean, there has to be. She can't just kick her out forever. Why haven't you just tried sneaking her inside? Oh my gosh, that's an amazing <laughs> idea. What? Haven't I thought of that? Oh, goodness, girl. Do I have to do everything around here? I don't know. Maybe? Okay, look. I'll help you, but if things go south, it's on you. Yes, yes! Oh my gosh. Thank you, Sophie! Oh, you are the best. I don't know how I'll ever, ever repay you. By not including me in any of your disasters of your life anymore? <laughs> yeah, no, that will never happen. Come on, let's go. You know, Britt, I've been doing a lot of running today. I'm getting tired. Oh, come on. We're here. Hey, Cammie! Hey, girl! Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to see you. Hey, Soph. Cammy, Sophie is here to help sneak you back into the house. You ready for this? Are you sure this is gonna work? Of course it is. It's my idea. Okay, come on. I'm gonna check to see if mom's home. Hello? Mom? Oh, mom? I don't think she's here. Oh, oh boy, you weren't kidding about this rule thing, huh? Yeah. 
No, I wasn't. Kimmy, coast is clear. Come on, let's go. La, 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 la. Nothing to see here. <gasps> so this is your parents' room? I've never seen it before. Sophie, get out of there. You don't want to be caught. Perfect, guys. We did it. Wow. Oh my goodness, it worked. Yes. Oh my bad, I missed it so much. Oh my gosh, thank you, Sophie. Sorry, I was just so excited to be back. Oh, don't mention it. I never said thank you. Hey, that's not true. I know. I just like to make you feel bad sometimes. So, uh, Kimmy, no offense, but you might want to do us all a favor and shower. Yikes. Oh, is it that bad? Yeah, you, you kind of smell like a garden. Ugh. <gasps> no, Mom's home. Oh, my goodness. Ah! Get down here now. Oh, gosh. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, I can't believe this. This is insanity. Wait, Mom? No, but Moms, are you kidding me? What is all over the floor? It's dirt. Where did this come from? I'm sorry. Yeah, Fritz, Mom. We're sorry. No, this is unacceptable. Rule number four. No messes. Loud ever. Yeah, Mom, I know. I'm really, really sorry. It was a mistake. Oh, don't worry. I know it wasn't you. It was this rat over here. Me? Mom? No, it wasn't Sophie. Please, it really wasn't me this time. I promise. I always check my shoes for dirt. I like playing in the mud, but I never make your house messy, Fritz, Mom. I don't believe you. You're a gross freak. Hey, Mom, Sophie's not a freak. Sure, she's a little crazy, but she's not gross. Shut up. I've had enough of people breaking my rules. Yikes, lady, you really are one mean mom. What did you just say, you little dirt monster? I said you're a mean mom. Oh, yeah? <laughs> I'll show you mean. You banned, you little brat. Huh? What the? No, Fritz, mom, don't, don't do it. Don't do it. Goodbye, Sophie. <gasps> mom, what just happened? <laughs> I kicked that little freak right out of my house. Now you better get cleaning. I want this entire house spotless. I want to be able to eat off these floors. Get to work. Seriously, this is gonna take forever. This house is huge and I'm not even close to being done. Most of the dirt off the stairs and over here, but the rest of the house is a mess. Well, not really. It actually kind of looks perfect. Oh, I just don't want to spend my whole night cleaning. Mom's low-key the worst. You know what? I'm just gonna give myself a little five-minute break. Put the mop and broom over here. Goodbye. Nothing like a little lemonade. Take a seat. Feet hurt from all this cleaning. I gotta make sure I don't leave this glass hanging around. I don't wanna break another one of my mom's rules. Hey kid, how's it going? Hey dad. Oh, yikes. Um, I'm sorry, but dad, you kinda smell like rotten cheese. What is, oh, did you forget deodorant today? <laughs> oh gosh, no, I was just at the gym. Gotta work off that turkey weight. You know what I'm saying? Holidays were too good to me. Well, dad, you gotta be careful before mom catches you. You should go shower, like right now. What, what are you talking about? Gotta make myself a protein shake first. No, dad, trust me, you do not wanna break mom's rule. Oh boy, she always has rules. It's so hard to keep up sometimes. No, dad, but this time she really means business. Gosh. Really well, so it would probably be for the best if you showered. <laughs> oh, kid, don't worry, I'll be fine. Now, where did those avocados go? What? No! No, 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 no. Oh, hey, <laughs> honey, I'm home. You smell like a dumpster full of leftover lasagna. Yikes. <laughs> I was at the gym. You stink. You broke my rule. What? <laughs> you can't be serious. Serious? Of course I'm serious. You don't break rules in this house, mister. Don't you understand anything? But Judy. My house, my rules. And if you can't follow them, you're sleeping on the couch tonight. What? No. Now go shower. Get your things out of the room. I don't want to see your face around here. See, Dad? I told you. Oh, man, I thought you were lying, but you're not kidding. Ugh, I cannot take my mom anymore. She's ridiculous. Ridiculous. All these rules. She's been yelling at everyone. She is so mean. But you know what? I'm gonna just sit down, watch some YouTube videos, and forget all about it. Oh my gosh, yes! Flamingo uploaded a new video. I'm definitely gonna watch that. He's literally one of my favorite content creators ever. Oh <laughs> wait, oh my gosh, no, are you serious? He's trolling like everyone. This is amazing. What is going on? Do I hear laughing? 
again. Oh, <laughs> yeah, mom, you are. But honestly, I'm sorry. I can't help but break this rule. Are you kidding me? I thought you were the good kid, but now you're the rule breaker. You know, there are consequences for breaking rules. Yeah, yeah, but mom, you have to see this video. It's hilarious. No. Come on, even you will find this funny. Watch it. Absolutely not. You are grounded. What? Grounded for laughing? You bet, Missy. You broke two rules. Rules number six and seven. No laughing and no happiness. I'm taking this. What? Your laptop. It's mine. Mom. I told you there were consequences. Good day, daughter. Oh, that's it. Okay, I've had enough. I can't deal with this anymore. I'm just so mad. I, I don't even know what to do. Now I can't even watch YouTube. What the heck am I supposed to do now? You know what? I'm gonna go talk to Cammie. Cammie, I've got an idea. Whoa, Brit, you scared me. What's up? I've had it up to here with mom. We're gonna do something about it. Oh yeah, look at us. We are breaking all of mom's stupid rules. Oh my gosh, Brit, she is going to be so mad. I know, this is so amazing. Honestly though, mom can't do anything worse than she already has. Yeah, you're totally right. Woo! This is awesome, Britt. I know, I'm having so much fun. Okay, it's a matter of time before mom shows up. She's gonna be so mad. Woo! And it's a matter of time before you and I get in the shower. We are starting to smell. It's perfect. We're breaking rule number five. No stinking. Oh, I called the blue one. Leave me alone, it's all for breaking the rules. What is going on? What are you doing here? Oh, hey mom, just breaking all your rules. <laughs> yeah, wanna join us? Absolutely not, stop right now. No mom, sorry, can't hear you through all the fun we're having. That's it, I have no choice. What is it mom? I got a surprise for you two brats. Follow me. Uh-oh, Cammy, I'm a little scared. Last time mom surprised us, we got all these rules in the first place. Yeah, I know. What's gonna happen, Britt? I don't know, but we should probably follow mom. And maybe it's nothing bad. <gasps> maybe we're gonna get a puppy finally. Oh my gosh, that would be so exciting. Where are you, losers? Uh, coming, mom. So, uh, what's the surprise? I got you two brand new bicycles over there. Why don't you go? Go check them out. Wait, seriously? Mom, that's really nice of you. Oh, I called the blue one. And I want the pink one. Whoa! Oh my gosh! I can't believe this. Yeah, neither can I. Maybe we took it too far. You think we took it too far? No way, sis. Mom did. I know. Now we're gonna have to live down here forever and smell like this forever. We should have brought deodorant. It's okay. I'm sure someone will come for us eventually. I don't know, Britt. Only thing's for sure is I really I really wish I could have ordered us some pizza. Do you think they deliver down here? Probably, but then we'd be stuck in a jail cell with a delivery guy. You could be odd. Yikes! And uh, no offense, Britt, but you really stink. I'm gonna stay over here and protect my nose. Hey, that's not fair, you smell too. Oh gosh, at least we're in this stink cloud together, huh? You're right, you're right. We gotta think of something. There's gotta be a way out, right? I'm all out of ideas. <gasps> Wait a second. Mom didn't take my phone away. Wait, seriously? Mm-hmm. I have it right here. Oh, that's perfect. I'm gonna call Sophie. Hey, Soph. Weird thing, but we're stuck in a secret basement at my house, so can you come and save us? Girl, you can't be serious. I know, I know, but okay, all you have to do is like, it's attached to my garage, I think, so look for it. I'm sure you can't miss it. You can probably smell us from underground. Oh, goodness, Britt. Call me if you get lost, bye! Oh my gosh, Britt, I'm so excited. For once, you're actually saving the day. I know, right? Kind of awesome for a change. Yeah! Oh, well, this is the place. Hey, Brett. Hey, Cammie. Sophie. Oh, my gosh. Yes, you're here. Soph, I'm so glad to see you. Oh, oh, boy. You got uh, some new pals around you. Some, some flies, huh? Yeah. All right, Soph. Work your Sophie Sampson magic and unlock the door. Please, we got to get out of here and shower. All right, girly. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> What do you think is going on here? Sophie is here to free us. Uh, Britt, on second thought. Sorry, girlies. This woman's terrifying. I'm out of here. Bye. Wait, no. Sophie, come back. Sophie. Sophie, come on. You can't be serious. <laughs> 
so much for your little prison escape, huh? You thought you could just be broken out after breaking all my rules? Mom, you can't keep us in here forever. Oh, I want these flies go away. I totally can. Fine, you win. But can you just answer one question for us? Ugh, fine, what is it? Why did you come up with all these stupid rules in the first place? Because I was sick of seeing you and your sister getting along. I hate it. But mom, that's not fair. Life's not fair. My sister never had fun with me and it ruined my life. So now I have to ruin yours. No, mom, you don't have to do that. Of course I do. No, mom, you should just be happy that your daughters broke the cycle of sisters not getting along. Huh, maybe you're right. Maybe I should be happy. I never thought of it that way. Yeah, mom, please just let us out. Fine, but under one condition. Okay, what is it? We keep one rule. Just please don't get dirt all over the floor like that ever again. Wait, seriously, Mom? That's it? Yeah, and uh, go shower right now. Mom! Dad! Is everything okay? Buy me a PS5. I want one right now. Oh no, Carla, did we forget his birthday again? I don't think so. Well then, sorry, son. It's not gonna happen. But I want one now! You'll have to wait for your birthday. I want a PS5. I'm gonna get one. They're gonna be so sorry they ever said no to me. Ah! Oh my gosh, what the heck is that noise? Oh no, did I sleep through another tornado? This is not good, what is going on out here? <gasps> Trevor, hey, what are you doing? Oh, hey Britt, were you the one making all that noise? Yeah, so what? So what, it's Saturday, I was trying to sleep. <laughs> I don't care. Well, what were you doing anyway? What's that? Oh, you know, just hanging up my new rules. <laughs> They're awesome and everyone has to follow them. Wait, rules? What are you talking about? Let me get a look at this. Yeah, because I'm sick of not getting everything I want. So now the whole family has to do what I say. Okay, wait, rule number one, no looking poor. Never go in my room. No glitter, no pink, no cute things allowed ever. <laughs> That's not happening. Give me all the allowance. I get first pick of everything. I don't do any chores and you can't tell anyone for free. Related? Trevor, what the heck? I don't care. These are rules, and if you break them, read the fine print, Brit. Breaking rules equals extreme consequences? Trevor, don't you think this is a little unfair? No, not at all. Well, you can't be serious, because these rules are ridiculous. You want to bet? Just try breaking one of my rules and see what happens. Okay, Trevor, I'm gonna go brush my teeth. You are crazy. I love the weekend. I'm just so excited to- Oh, hey, Mom. What's up? Brittany, dear, what do you think you're doing? Oh, I was just about to throw on a little spy family on TV. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, you're funny. Not until after you finish your weekend chores. Wait, chores? Oh, Trevor dear. What do you want, mom? You're just in time for your chore assignment. <laughs> yeah, okay, not doing that. Dear, yes you are. You are going to wash the floor, mow the lawn. Nope. Not happening, Mom. Yes, it is, Mr. And Brittany, for you, I would like you to do the dishes, clean the bathrooms, and vacuum. The dishes again? Oh, I hate doing the dishes, Mom. Well, I'm sorry. Get to it. And then you guys can have a great weekend. Uh, no. Remember rule number six, Mom. Uh, what? Rule number six. I don't do chores. Oh, boy. Well, I don't have time for this. Just make sure it's all done by the time I get home. I'm going to the grocery store. Store. Huh, you excited to do all my chores, Brit? You definitely have to help me. That was a super long list. I'm not doing anything. Well, that's totally unfair. Life's not fair, idiot. Oh, hey kids. Uh, how's it going? Uh, Trevor, were you yelling at Brittany? Yeah, Dad, Trevor's not gonna help out with the chores. Trevor, help your sister with the chores. No, I'm not helping her. Never. What do you mean, never? Give this to me. Ha! Oh. What the? Well, somebody's got to clean this up. Trevor! Ha, it's not gonna be me. What in the world? Brit, what has gotten into him? I don't know, Dad. He's the worst brother ever. He's so spoiled. Oh, man. I am exhausted. But I think I'm finally done with all the chores. I am going to put this mop and broom away. Oh, man. I just need to take a seat. I'm so tired. I never want to clean again. Trevor! Brittany! Where are you? Oh, I really hope it's no more chores. Hey, Dad, 
What's up? The house looks fantastic. Now, where is your brother? Oh, hey, Dad. <laughs> Sorry, I was just cleaning. Well, the house looks great. Thanks. It was all me. You know, I did it all. Wait, what the heck? No, you didn't, Trevor. I did. All right, whatever. He said, she said. Now, kids, here's your allowance. Now, don't be spending it all in one place. Thanks, Dad. Yeah, don't mention it. All right, loser. Hand it over. What? No, if anything, you should hand me your allowance because I was the one who did all the cleaning. Nah, uh uh. Rule number four I get all the allowance. Trevor, I'm not following your stupid rules, okay? Oh, yeah. Ah! Yeah, I'm not following them. You can't make me. Yes, I can. Get over here. No, 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 it's not happening. Hand over your money, Brit. Uh, no, locking the door. <laughs> Perfect. How about you stay in there? All right. Where does she keep her piggy bank? Ha, perfect. There it is. I'll be taking this. Ha, she's not going to give me all her money. I'm just going to take it. All mine now. I think he ran away. Perfect. The coast is clear. He's so annoying. He's literally the worst brother in the world. How to put my money in my piggy bank. Wait. What the heck? Where is it? <gasps> no. No. No, no, no. Trevor, did you steal my piggy bank? Hand over the piggy bank now! Not happening! Trevor! Rules are rules. I get all the allowance. That's not okay. Hand over my money. Nope. Finders keepers. And actually, I'll be taking this. What the heck? What's wrong with you? You can't steal all my money. Just did. Haha. <laughs> Loser. Ugh. He's the worst. These rules are so stupid. Oh, man, Brett. Your mom really outdid herself with these cookies. This is her best batch yet. <laughs> Thanks, so Fala. <laughs> be sure to tell her. Oh, yeah. I could just sit here all day and eat them. They're amazing. Oh, Sophie, speak of amazing, I want to show you the new sweater I just bought upstairs in my room. Oh, girl, I gotta see this. I need to know what I'm gonna steal from you. Hey, don't steal, I'll let you borrow it. Ah, same difference. What, <gasps> what the heck happened to my room? Uh, Brett, are, are you sure this is your room? Yeah, what happened to everything? Like, all of my stuff is gone, and everything's not so pink. Uh, yeah, everything's way less pretty-ish. There's literally, like, no pink. Ugh, gives me the creeps. Oh, no. I know that laugh. <gasps> what the heck is he doing? Brit, it looks like he's burning stuff. That's exactly what he's doing. He's burning all of my pink things so... Oh, that's it. Nobody, and I mean nobody messes with my bestie. I can't believe him. Trevor, what the heck are you doing? <laughs> oh, you know, just doing a little cleanup. No, Trevor, don't do it. Put down the just hand my things over. Nope, I don't think so. Why are you doing this? This is my stuff. You failed to follow rule number three. Uh, rule number three? Yeah, absolutely no glitter, no pink, no cute things allowed ever. Well, you can't do this to me. Ah, yes, I can. Say goodbye to your little unicorn. No! Mom, I need to talk to you. Brittany, dear, what's going on? It's Trevor. He's out of control. Oh, Britt, don't worry. It is just a phase. It'll pass. He burnt all my things, Mom. <laughs> I doubt that, Brittany. No, I'm serious. He did, and he, like, completely changed my room. It doesn't even look like my room anymore. These stupid rules of his are getting out of control. Well, dear, dinner's ready. Why don't you go get your brother, and maybe you can talk to him. There is no way I'm going to talk to him, Mom. Brittany? Oh, fine. We'll go get him. Thank you. Stupid. Don't get why I always have to be the bigger person. Trevor's the worst. Trevor! Trevor? Hey, it's time for dinner. Where is that siren coming from? Ah! What the heck? Why am I down here? I am in like a prison? Did my brother build a trap door? Somebody, hey, let me out! Ha, that's what you get for going into my room. Trevor, let me out of here. No, you broke a rule. There are consequences. I only went into your room to get you for dinner. Now let me out. Ha, no way. Good thing dinner's ready. I'm hungry. Oh, Trevor, get me out of here. I still cannot believe that mom made me come to the store with you. Yeah, you're telling me. I don't want anyone to see me here with you. I mean, look at you. You're so lame. What? No, I'm not lame. You're lame. You 
were lame first. Ugh, just whatever. Can we get this over with? You have the shopping list? Yeah. Mom wants us to get some cheddar cheese. Come on, quick. Oh, you're so annoying. Hmm. Okay, well, I don't know what cheese is what. Hold on. I don't believe my eyes. It's my grandbabies. Oh, hey, Nana. What are you two doing here? What the heck did you just say, Nana? I said hello to my grandbabies. What is wrong with you? I'm confused. Grandma, you idiot. You broke my rule. I did what, dear? Rule number seven. People can't know Brit and I are related. You're seriously gonna make Nana follow the rules too? Oh, you bet. And Nana, you're late on giving me my birthday money. Oh, dear. I'm, I'm so sorry. I forgot. Hand it over, Nana. I'm so sorry here. Thanks. Now, security! Wait, Trevor, you cannot be serious. Oh, I am. Security! Trevor, how can I help you? Take that old lady away right now. Trevor, dear, you don't have to be doing this. Nana, you broke a rule, and this is what happens when you break my rules. You should have never said we were related. All right, Nana, let's get moving. Wait, stop. Oh, no. Come on, up to, up to. You're coming with me. No! Yeah, you heard me. Get out. <laughs> Son, don't you think you're being a bit ridiculous? It, it'll be okay. Don't worry, dear. No, this is insanity. I don't care what it is. Get out now. Wait a second. What's going on upstairs? Everyone's yelling. Hey, is everything okay? Your brother's kicking us out and taking our room. It's true. Wait, what? You cannot be serious. Yeah, I'm serious. My room's too small and I want a bigger room. Uh, I guess we'll... Uh... Start moving. Trevor, you really can't be doing this. This is mom and dad's room. <laughs> I'm already doing it. And they're gonna move all my stuff in here too. I'm not gonna have to lift a finger. I wanna make sure they're packing everything right. Mom, dad, stop. You can't let him do this. It's fine, dear. It's fine. No, he's being spoiled. You can't let him kick you out of your own bedroom. You know what? Brittany is right. Carla, he has gone off the deep end. No, I haven't. Now you guys aren't moving fast enough. I want to be in my new room by tomorrow. Oh boy, my back's gonna give out. Mom, seriously, stop. I'll listen to you if you tell him no. Dear, it's okay. Maybe a change of pace will be fun. This room is cozy. Hurry up. Move it or lose it. Oh, oh dear. And Brett, get out of my room. Gosh, you're unreal. Brittany. What's up, dad? Happy birthday. <laughs> oh, thanks, dad. You remembered. Of course I did. Now, come on downstairs your mother and i got you a little something <gasps> oh my gosh i'm so excited i love my birthday and oh, wait a second <gasps> oh my gosh presents <laughs> thank you oh now where is your mother i know she's gonna want to watch you open these let me go find her hmm interesting trevor what are you doing oh picking out my gift your gift what are you talking about it's my birthday don't you remember the rules uh no because your rules are dumb why don't you go look at the list behind me or the one over here or the one by the tv or the ones everywhere oh my gosh okay what is it rule number five i get first pick of everything and that's including your birthday gifts wait what oh my gosh no that's so stupid you're not taking my birthday gifts you can wait for your birthday no i'm not gonna because you know why i get what i want and you're just a dumb loser wait what the heck what are you doing taking my gifts this one seems to be the most expensive one trevor put that down it's mine nope it's mine. Come on, please just give it back. This is not okay. Too bad. I get first pick of everything. It's a rule. <laughs> uh, Britt, sorry to rain on your parade, but is that your terrible brother over there? Huh? Wait, yeah, it is. What is he doing? Hmm, I don't know. I'm gonna go get a closer look. Be careful, Sophie. All right, hand it over. Give me your allowance. Oh, man, do we have to? Yeah, I don't wanna. I worked real hard. Me too. Do you want a consequence? Oh, no, mister. Here, take mine. The mine. Well, I guess you could have mine, too. Ha, ha, ha. Perfect. Now get lost, losers. Oh, I'm out of here. Ah! Right, 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 right. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Um, we got a big problem.
problem? What is it, Soph? Not only did your brother take the allowance of those small children, he took my allowance too! <gasps> no, that's it. I've had enough. This is the final straw. I am sick and tired of my brother being so spoiled. Me? Wait, so we can't just run over there and scream at him just yet. Gotta come up with a good plan. I don't know if I can wait, Britt. I'm pretty mad. I know, I know. Sophie, I am too, but we gotta think about this. He needs to be stopped. Ha, I'll take one of those and one of those. Oh, definitely these. These are sick. Okay, your total today is $10,542. Perfect, here you go. Um, do you want to... Try that again. Looks like your card's declined. What? No, you gotta be kidding me. Yeah, um, are you poor? No! I want these clothes! Uh, what exactly is going on here? Oh, well, you all look so poor. And that's breaking rule number one. <gasps> I look poor? Hey, son, watch your words. No, because what's even worse is you are poor. What are you talking about? No, we're not poor. Yeah, son. No, it's true. I was out buying new clothes for everyone so we'd stop looking so poor, but the card was declined. You stole our credit card? You bet I did. We don't even have $10,000. What type of family is this? You tried to spend $10,000 at a clothing store? You gotta get a hold of yourself, son. Yes, this is unreal. No, what's unreal is I live with poor idiots. We're not poor idiots. Yes, you are. Well, mister. Son, you better return all those items right away. No! I'm not doing anything you say. I'm your father. You'll listen to me. Tough luck, old man. Uh, oh, my goodness. I, I just, I'm at a loss. I, I don't know what to do. He might actually be broke now. Wait, seriously? Mom, Dad, we'll get to the bottom of this. We just have to stop Trevor from being so spoiled and entitled. Uh, I don't know. We we've tried for years, and it look at where it got us now. Oh, goodness. Oh, man, I'm gonna have to sell all my jewelry. Don't worry, Mom and Dad. We'll stop him. We no, I'm not supposed to go into his room, but I don't care anymore. I'm mad. He's upset mom and dad. He stole money. You don't do that. Trevor, open this door right now. Go away, Britt. I'm going to barge in if you don't open this door. <laughs> Ugh, that's it. I warned you. I'm coming in. What is your problem and why are you doing this? You're awful. Awful? I'm not awful. You are. I mean, look at you. You're a total loser. A freak. You're being a spoiled brat. Ha, why, thank you. No, uh, what is wrong with you? That is not a compliment. No one is ever gonna like you if you keep acting this way. You're gonna lose all your friends and your family. Oh yeah, you think I care? Well, I don't. Well, you really should. You know what, Britt? I've had enough of you. You're so annoying, you think you can make all the rules. Well, guess what? I made the rules and you have to follow them. What? Hey, put me down. Where are you taking me? I'm making sure you never, ever come to my room again. Trevor, put me down. This is crazy. Nope. <laughs> Hope you like living out in the shed. What? No, Trevor. No, you can't do this. Shut up. You're so annoying, Brit. Now you're finally out of my hair and I can get whatever I want. What? Oh, no, Trevor, open up. You can't lock me in here. Ah! Oh my gosh, there's a spider over here. I'm not gonna touch that bike ever again. Oh, I don't wanna be in here. There's spiders. It's creepy, it's cold, and I don't wanna live in a shed. Oh, my brother is the worst. Why did he lock me in here? I'm gonna have to live in here forever or till spring when there's no more snow on the ground and my dad has to mow the lawn. Oh, speaking of which, what if I just hop on this lawnmower and like drive straight through the door. Yeah, that'll work. That, that's gotta break the lock, right? Here goes nothing. Uh, I'm not good at driving this thing. Three, two, one, here we- Brittany! Oh my gosh, Dad! What are you doing in here? The, the door was locked. Oh my gosh, well, yeah, that's because Trevor locked me in here. Carla, Carla, I found her. She, she's over here. Oh, oh great. I thought she was stuck in the grill. Brittany, I'm so glad to see you. Yeah, Carla, you won't believe it, but Trevor locked her in here. <gasps> that is it. I have had it. This boy is in big trouble. No more Miss Nice Mom. Carla, Carla. Oh no. Guys, this isn't good. Mom's mad. This is scary. My mom never gets mad. Mister? What's up, Mom? Like my new fit? No. Mister, I am done with this. Uh, you're not mad, are, are you, Mom? Mad? 
Oh, I'm way beyond mad. I am furious. You need to stop acting like a spoiled brat. But, but mom. Uh, Don't you but mom me. You're grounded. Uh, this isn't fair. Isn't this great? This is so cool, mom. You? What are you doing? Get out of here! You heard me scram! Mom? I don't know you. Go away! Mom? How could you? Mommy is doing famous stuff right now. Go home! You heard the lady. Now get lost! <laughs> I don't believe this! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Woo! Yeah, Brad, happy birthday! Aw, thanks, guys. You shouldn't have. Open my present first! Open my present first! <laughs> okay, bestie. Which one is it? Let me go get it. Oh, I'm so excited. I can't believe it. Look how many presents. And this cake. It's adorable. Make sure you open my present last. It's the best. Girls, I brought the tacos. Yes. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much for throwing me this party, Mom. Of course. Anything for my wonderful daughter. You know, you guys really didn't have to get me that many gifts. That's so kind of you. Well, it's your birthday. Oh. Hold on one second, I'm getting a call. I wonder who that could be. Oh my gosh, it's probably Aunt Bertha calling to wish you a happy birthday. Oh my gosh, remember that time she made you babysit her pet rock? Ugh, sis, don't remind me. Girls, girls, great news. Oh, what is it, Mom? I just landed an audition of a lifetime. Oh my gosh, Mom, that's so awesome, yay. Congrats. When's the audition? It starts in 25 minutes, so I gotta go. But Mom, it's my birthday birthday. So what? There'll be another one next year. Wish me luck! Seriously? What the heck? Uh, don't worry, Britt. We'll still have fun. How could mom leave me on my birthday? In the middle of the party. I know. I'm sorry. I just really wish mom was around more. Wait a minute. What the? Happy birthday, bestie! <laughs> oh my gosh, a lawnmower? You got her a lawnmower. Sure did. Hope you like it. Oh my goodness. Think so. Don't mention it. Isn't this thing awesome? I am just so glad I could take you shopping with me. Me too. Hmm. Now, what should I wear to my next TV appearance? Oh, um, let's see. I don't know. Uh, maybe this really cute purple sweater? Ew, terrible. Oh, uh, okay. Or, um, ooh, I don't know. <gasps> what about this over here? It looks so awesome on you. Even worse. You know, this is the hardest part about being famous. What is? You just never know what to wear. Oh, I thought you'd say missing out on quality time with your kids. No, not really. Whoa, wait a minute. Hold on. <laughs> Trisha, Trisha, over here. Oh, hi. Smile for the Daily News. Oh, great. The paparazzi again. Make sure you get my good side. Whoa, wait a minute. Is that? Oh, my amazing daughter. Why, yes, it is. Brittany, come here and pose with mom. Oh, this is great. This will be on the front page for sure. Wait, mom. I hate getting my picture taken. Just pose. Okay, fine. Stupid. You look great. Just smile. What an amazing mom. You're one lucky kid, you know. Oh, and do you know we celebrated her birthday yesterday? I threw her the biggest party in all of Roblox. Whoa, you deserve mother of the year. Amazing. <laughs> I know, don't I? All right, that's enough. Great photos. Enjoy your day. Mom, why did you just lie to that photographer? Lie? I didn't lie. Yeah, you kind of did, Mom. Oh, Brittany Botox isn't a lie. No, about my birthday party. You left like right when it started. Oh, hold on. Phone's ringing. Let me go get this. I need privacy. Frustrating. Seriously? Oh my gosh, like I didn't want to say it, but whoa! It's so cool, famous person's in the store, and I wish my mom was famous. <sighs> Trust me, it's not all it's cracked up to be. Yeah, right, it's like so totally cool. I wish I was you. Shopping's over, time to go. I have a meeting with my agent. Wait, what? Yep, gotta go. Mom, hey, mom, uh, wait up. Where is my mom? Brett, hey girl, what are you still doing here? Oh, just waiting for my mom to come pick me up. Wait a minute, were you in detention with me? 
I didn't see you there. No, I've just been waiting here. What? In the pineapples, girl? It's like 8 p.m. You've been waiting out here since school got out? I know, yeah. Dude, where in the world is your mom? I don't know. She's probably running late again. Or she forgot to pick you up again. No, I mean, I I'm sure she's just, I don't know, stuck in traffic, running late. It's okay. Oh, my mom's here. Want me to ask her if she'll drive you home? Could you, so? That'd be awesome. Hey, mom! We're driving my bestie home. Okay, sure. Come on in. Thank you, Mrs. Sampson. This is the third time this week your mom's forgotten you, dear. I know. Thanks for driving me home. I really appreciate it. Anytime. Mom! Mom, are you home? Oh, good, you're home. I was just on my way out. The limo should be here any minute. Mom, did you forget something today? No, I don't think so. Maybe to pick me up from school? That again? Ugh. Mom, that's like the third time this week. Sorry, I just got caught up in more important things like being famous. It's true, you really are a star, Trisha. But mom, I waited like five hours for you. Huh, and that's her problem, kids these days. Well, here, take some money and buy yourself dinner tonight or whatever. Not hungry. Okay, look, we gotta go. We're gonna be late for Harry Styles' party. Oh! Oh, oh, goodness, no, we can't miss that. Then we need to head straight to Mr. Beast's party right after. Let's move it. Time is money. Okay. Girl, your mom is terrible. I know. I just don't know what's gotten into her lately. Well, sure beats the tomatoes out of me. Well, thanks for joining me for dinner, at least. No prob. Anything for a free meal. Now, come on. Okay. But, girl, seriously, I don't know what to do about my mom. Why don't you just be honest with her? I don't know, so... Girl, honesty is the best policy. Just tell your mom that you don't like her trying to act all famous and whatnot. Yeah, but you no, know, I've already tried that. And? And she didn't listen. Oh, man, okay. Ugh. Back to the drawing board. Oh, excuse me, girls, but I've seemed to misplace my pet alligator. Oh my gosh, a pet alligator? Yes, his name is Jonathan. Have you seen him? Scramble lady, he ain't here. Oh, Goodness, your mean little one. Fine. Jonathan, Jonathan, get back here. Sophie, why were you mean to that old lady? She interrupted me. Again! Now, where was I? Hmm. Aha! I got it. What if we crash that fancy pants party or something? You know, that's not a bad idea. And maybe we can get famous, and my mom will want to hang out with me. Exactly. Plus, everyone knows I'm the real star out of the two of us. Hey, wait a minute. What did you just say? Nothing. Come on, I'll drive. Whoa. Oh my gosh, here we are, Sophie. Look at all these crazy cool cars. Oh my goodness. This is so cool. All right, come on, let's go. Oh, hey there. Super cool party. Hey, wait a minute. And what do you think you're doing here? We're coming to party, my dude. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, absolutely not. What? Oh, come on, please. Not a chance. You're not famous. You're nobodies. What did you just call us? Nobodies. Non-famous losers. Well, can I at least talk to my mom for a second? No! Get lost, kid! Wait a second. Bestie, are you seriously gonna let this guy get away with being rude? No. I have an idea. Come with me. Oh, boy. Not this again. No, trust me. It'll work. Every fancy pants party needs a fancy pants server to serve the fancy food. True. True. All right. Come on. Let's go. <clears throat> Uh, hello there. There you are, finally. Sorry, sir, we got stuck in the traffic. Well, stop wasting more time and get in there. There are starving people needing food. Okay, thank you. Whoa, Sophie, hey, look, there are so many people. Whoa, this is so cool. Dude, I know, seriously, this is awesome. I keep looking around. Oh, hello. Oh my gosh, where could my mom Pardon me? Um, uh, how is the food? Yeah, it's great. Awesome. Wait a minute. Uh, hold that thought. Brittany? Sophie? Uh, uh-oh. What are you doing here? I just came by to see you. No, you, you can't be here. But Britt's mom. No, this is a party for famous people and famous people only. A lady we want to be famous too. Trisha, Trisha, is everything okay? Uh, I heard anger. No, everything is Okay. Wait a second. Oh, you, you're not waiters. Get out of here. But I just wanted to. Nope, get out. Get out. Wait. Whoa. Oh my goodness. But mom. Rules are rules. Ah, dead. Get out of here. Move it, move it, move it. Fine. 
goodness. Excuse me. Sorry. Sophie, come on. Let's go. Mom, what the heck? Why did you get me kicked out of the party? Dear, quiet down. I'm reading my new script. And besides, you would not understand. Well, yeah. No kidding. Of course I don't understand. You're my mom. Why would you get me kicked out of a party? I thought you'd be happy to see me. Look, dear. I've wanted to be famous my whole life. And now that I am, I'm just a little busy. Too busy to be my mom? Well, what can I say? That is so not cool. Yo, Britt, why are you complaining? What do you mean? Mom being famous is like the coolest thing ever. See, your brother understands. I mean, come on. I got free movie tickets for like a whole year. Yeah, but don't you miss mom? She's never around. And when she is, she always leaves us for famous people things. I don't know. I mean, I'm good. Oh, speaking of missing me, you better not miss me too much because I'm going to Brookhaven to film a movie for three months. What? Three months? Whoa, cool mom. Can I have your car? I don't see why not. Whatever you want, dear. Now I've got to go. I can't believe this. This is so stupid. Seriously? Ugh. Yo, Britt, don't be all upset. If you want, you can have maybe one of my free movie tickets. No, Dan, I don't want a movie ticket. I want my mom back. So why do you drag me here to Brookhaven again? Well, my mom has to live here for three months while she films her new movie. Oh, well, that's pretty cool. We used to chill in Brookhaven all the time. Yeah, that's true. We had so many fun adventures, but now I'm just so sad. Wouldn't an appearance from my favorite ex, Sheila, make you feel better? <laughs> yeah, I think so. That kind of helps, but I don't know. Honestly, I just don't want my mom to be famous anymore. All right, let's walk and talk. I'm hungry. I mean, is that so wrong of me to not want my mom to be famous? Hello, ladies. Welcome to Spurrigals. Hi there. Can I get a bubblegum ice cream, please? Of course. <gasps> oh, wait a minute. You're Trisha's daughter. I thought I recognized you. Oh, yeah, that's me. <laughs> awesome. Free ice cream on the house. Your mom is so talented. She's the best actress I know. No, that's okay. I really don't mind paying. No need. I'm a huge fan. Let the woman pay. Yikes. Fine. That'll be four fifty. dollars Here you go. All right. Thank you. Have a great day. See, girl. Have a famous mom isn't that bad. I mean, free ice cream is kind of awesome. No, I'd give up all the free ice cream in the world if I can just have my mom back. Girl, you're wild. But what can you do? This is your new life now. Your mom's famous. My mom's just my mom. And uh, yeah. Girls, let's get moving. Hold on. Where are we going? To the movie set. Come on. You're going to be late. Cool. Ride in the limo. Go jump our best seat. This is awesome. Whoa, this is pretty cool. Yeah, girl, I have never been to a movie set before and look at this place. Can't believe they're filming in a mansion. Yeah, this is pretty cool. Oh, girls, there you are. I'm so glad to see you. Mom. You're not gonna kick us out again, are you? Oh, <laughs> don't be silly. So what are we doing here? I thought I'd bring you here to share some amazing news. <gasps> oh my gosh, say you're getting a puppy. Say you're getting uh, no, no. This new movie I'm in is going to make me, your mom, the most famous person in all of Roblox. What? Congrats, mom. That's really cool. I know. It's beyond. Well, maybe do you think after this wraps, I don't know, we could like go on vacation as a family or something? Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Like a family vacation featuring Sophie, of course. Yep, uh-huh. Yep, yep. Mm -hmm. Great, sure. Uh, Trish, I'm on the phone with another studio and they want you to not make a single plan once this film wraps. You've got it. Hold on, what are you two doing here? Uh, you brought us here, my dude? Yeah, and I'm spending time with my mom. Britt, I have to get back to work. No time to waste when you're amazing and famous like me. But mom, what about the vacation we were talking about? Well, you heard my agent. I don't have time for that. Mom, you realize you're basically saying you don't have time for your own family anymore. There's more to life than just being famous. Not really, dear. Look, Trisha, I've been patient enough. If you don't come back to set, I'll have to cut you from this scene. Actors these days. Oh, look what you made me do, Brit. If you weren't bothering me, I wouldn't be losing camera time. Are y'all just purposely forgetting that you brought us here? I want you to leave. Look, Bestie, everything's gonna be okay. This is just a phase. I'm sure your mom will go back to normal. And besides, we get to chill on this really cool movie set. Yeah, but she doesn't even seem like my mom anymore. She's like a totally, completely different person. Ah! <laughs> no, they're gonna 
gonna ruin me and my career. Oh. Mom, what's going on? The director, he's going off script and completely changed the movie. Oh no. Yep, and now I went from the leading role to the smallest role possible. Delivery driver number five. Number five, Brittany. Uh, yikes. I'm so sorry, Mom. This is terrible. Terrible. <laughs> All right. Um, hey, I'm sorry, Trisha, but I'm no longer going to work with you. But Charles. Nope, you're a nobody. And I don't work with nobodies. Please, just give me a chance. What? Who's that talking? Oh, that's right. A nobody. Goodbye. My world is falling apart. Everything's ruined. Look, Mom, there's no need to cry. Even if you're not the most famous person in Roblox, I still love you. Aw, uh, ain't that sweet? No, I need to fix this immediately. Well, I don't know. Maybe I can help. I hate seeing my mom so upset. I'm gonna go ask that director what is going on with my mom's role. I'm really nervous. Um, hi, excuse me. Mr. Director Man? Yes, that is me. What is going on, kid? Um, hey, I kind of wanted to talk to you about my mom's role. Ah, uh, yes. All right, well, you see, kid, things change. What do you mean, things change? Look, the studio wanted to update the film with a better idea. And the better idea was to take my mom's role out completely? I mean, delivery driver number five is no easy role. Besides, I was actually wanting to come talk to you. Wait, really? Yes, you are going to be the star of the film now. <gasps> what? Your coffee, sir? Margaret, I'm busy. Can't you see that? Oh, uh, I'm, I'm so sorry, sir. Wait, you're talking about me? Why, yes. You. Is this some kind of joke or something? No, not at all. You see, your mom's acting skills have been going down the toilet, and uh, we need someone younger, and you're the perfect fit. And besides, her fans will want to see you in the movie because you're her daughter, the leading star. So you want to get me famous at the risk of ruining my mom's career? <laughs> Honey, this is the name of the game. Famous for now and not forever. I don't know. This doesn't seem right. You are one lucky kid go for it that's what your mother would do really you think I, I don't know hold on just a minute here let me get my phone because I have an agent who just got rid of a client he'd love to work with you he's the best in the business hello wait let me take a minute I need to think about this okay but this amazing offer will not last forever <laughs> My best friend is famous. My best friend's famous. Whoa! I don't know, Sophie. Oh, come on, Brett. This is, like, so totally cool. Why don't you understand how cool this is? Yeah, it's cool and all, but if I accept this role, my mom's heart's gonna be broken. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yep. I see that. But, like, you're famous! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Hey! Oh, my gosh! I can't help Brittany! It's you! Whoa! Um, oh, whoa! Ha! Hi, hi there. <laughs> Let me please get an autograph. Please, 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 please. Yeah, I, sure. <laughs> okay, to, um, what's your name? Harvey. Oh, oh, yes. <laughs> Here you go. To you, Harvey. Um, thanks for being a fan. Oh, my goodness. Thank you. Another quick question. Um, uh, can I please be in the boat? You? With that face? Oh, get out of here, buddy. But I... Uh, Kick rocks, pal! Whoa! I said move it, get out of here. Whoa! Hey, hey, leave that guy alone, Sophie, stop! You know, I would make one amazing bodyguard. Yeah, I mean, I, I guess so. But so I don't want to do this. I've decided I just want my mom back. I've said it a million times. Then quick, girl, who cares? You're right. I'm going to go talk to that director. Good luck! <gasps> Please, can I have my role back? Please. Uh, no, absolutely not. You are terrible. Now leave my movie set. Oh, look. There she is. The shining star. What? No, that, that, that's not me. I'm over here. <laughs> Look, director guy, I'm not going through with this. What? But why? Because you're mean. You made my mom cry. And besides, I don't want fame. <gasps> what? What do you mean? Brittany! It's true. Fame is stupid. It ruined my family and I want no part of it. What? No, get, get back here! Brittany! Brittany, wait up! Ugh. What is it, Mom? You're right. I didn't realize it until you said it, but fame really has ruined our family. I'm so so sorry. Do you even really mean it? Or is this some other, like, audition for a role of a sad mom? No, dear, of course I 
mean it. I'm sorry. I put fame before family and that's not okay. What do you say we go get some dinner and make up for it? I've missed you. Wait, really? I love that. I've missed you too, mom. I am so upset. My parents left me at the daycare and they haven't come back to get me. And it's been like seven days, which is a full week. I don't know what to do. They abandoned me and now I'm all alone and I don't know where to go. I'm just a little kid. Hey, you, what are you doing? A lady, oh, hi, hi. I'm lost. My family left me here and I don't know where to go or what to do. Can you help me? This place isn't it. Orphanage. I know, but I just don't know where to go. I'm just a kid. Please, ma'am, can you please help me? Oh, fine, come with me. I'll adopt you. You will? You'll adopt me? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh! That would be so awesome! Even though you're gross, kids are gross. <gasps> wow, this lady sure doesn't sound like she wants to adopt me, but I'm not gonna say anything. Thank you! You better be good or else you'll end up alone again. <gasps> Oh, guys, uh, no pressure or anything. I mean, I promise I won't let you down. I'll be like the best kid that could ever exist. I, I won't cry. I, I won't ask for any food. I, I really kind of won't do anything. Hurry up and follow. I have a cooking show coming on soon. Oh, oh, yes, okay. Oh, oh, right away, ma'am, new mom, lady. Oh, whatever you want. Wish me luck with my new mom. Wow. Oh, okay, so we are outside my new mom's house, and this house is huge. But my mom Mom's name is Sharon. She'll be sharing the house with me, that's for sure. <laughs> this is my house. Whoa, uh, yeah, it is. It's so pretty. Way better than my last house, which was, uh, the outdoors. Don't touch anything with your hands. No sticky fingers. Oh, uh, well, okay, I promise. I, I won't touch a single thing. I'll be really, really good, I swear. I promise you. Now follow. You mom? Whoa, check this place out. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. This house is super cool. Yum, look, they're apples and oranges. Oranges, those are bananas. No touching. Whoa, okay. Uh, I'm sorry, mom. Living room, here, no sitting on the couch. Uh, okay, sounds good. This lady has a lot of rules. Whoa, there are a lot of stairs to climb as a little kid. Wow, <gasps> what a beautiful bedroom. This bed is so cozy, I love it. Look at this plant, it's my size. <laughs> my room, don't come in here ever. Oh, uh, noted, I will never ever come in here. Even if I have a bad dream and I, I want my mom's help, I will never come in here. Where is my room? I'm super excited to see it. I, I hope it's really, really nice. I mean, everything in here is nice. No questions. What? Whoa. Um. Okay, I I'm sorry. I, I shouldn't have asked anything. First, some house rules. Okay, uh, she already has a lot of rules, so I don't know if I'm ready for all these new ones. I am the boss. I get that, and you're my mom, so what you say goes. You must keep clean. Spotless. Okay, I got that. That should be easy enough. You are never, ever, ever allowed out of the house without me. Okay, okay, gotcha. That sounds great. It's important to have rules because, you know, you'll never learn right from wrong if you don't have them. So I I'm excited. They're a, a little strict, but I, I can for sure do this. Now here is your room. Whoa, oh my gosh, wow. I even have my very own computer. This is everything. I'm so excited. Thank you for adopting me. Remember the rules. Yes, of course. I'll keep everything clean. I won't go in your room. I, I won't sit on the couch. I, I won't touch anything. Okay. <gasps> I think I already broke that rule. Oh no! Go to bed now. Be quiet while mommy sleeps. Sure thing. Good night, mom. She, she didn't even say good night. Well, uh, that's okay. <laughs> She's probably just, uh, I don't know, tired herself. Well, I'm gonna go catch some Z's and I will see you guys in the morning. Okay, it's been a few months since I've been adopted by my mean mom and it's just not going well, guys. I I'm trying my best to get along with her, but it's like everything I do is not good enough. I clean the floors like two to three times a day, but look, I'm little. So the broom and the mop just don't really work that well. But you know, I'm really trying my best and maybe just maybe one day it'll get better. But for now, I'm just 
gonna go with the flow. My mom will almost be home soon, and that's a good thing because I already have her dinner all cooked and ready to go. And uh, maybe I'll just vacuum a little bit more. I think I left a crumb or two over here. Oh gosh, she's gonna be so mad. Oh, oh she's home. Um, huh, hi mom, welcome home. It's so good to see you. I hope you had the best day ever. Thanks. Yeah, of course. Did you have a good day? I mean, I had a fairly good day. School was tough and then I cleaned and all that. No, it was awful. <gasps> oh my, I got fired. <gasps> you got fired? Oh my, that's so bad. I'm really sorry for being too mean. Whatever that means. I can totally see why she got fired. She is super mean. She's like the meanest mom to ever exist, but uh, I'm not gonna say that to her, of course. Nope, that's very, very rude. I'm hungry. Oh, well, don't worry. I have your dinner ready. I hope you like my steak and mashed potatoes. I worked super, super hard on it. Here you go, mom. Uh, There's your dinner. Good, let me have my dinner. Here is your dinner, mom. I hope you enjoy Enjoy it? Ew! You call this food? Yeah, I do. I worked super hard on it. You don't like it? It tastes like trash. What? Okay, you know what? I've kind of had it, Mom. Enough is enough. I worked super hard on it, and I'm sorry you don't like it. I hate it. You're the worst. Seriously? I'm the worst? No, you're the worst. You're so mean. I can't believe it. I try super hard to be the best daughter I could be, and you say my food tastes like trash? What did you say? You heard me, lady. You are mean, and I have just had enough of it. You just talked back to me. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I did. I'm standing up for myself, guys, because she is being so mean. You bet. I worked so hard on that dinner. You're in trouble now. Fine, I'll take a punishment. I'm sleeping in the garage. No room for you now. Fine, I'd rather be in the garage anyway. At least it's away from you. You're the worst. Man, my mom is so mean. I just don't get it. I try my hardest to be the best daughter I can be, but nothing is good enough for this woman. Maybe I'll just sit out here and think and come up with some kind of way to Get through to that lady. I wanna know why she's so mean. Oh, I gotta tell you, sleeping in the garage was, I don't know, kinda nice. It was nice and cool in here and quiet. But wait a minute, I keep on hearing this sound. I don't know what it is. I'm gonna go in the house and check it out. Okay, this is super weird, but it sounds like someone's crying. <gasps> Do you think it's my mom? No, I mean, I don't even think that woman has any emotion other than mean in her head. It, it sounds like it's coming from upstairs. I, I'm gonna go check on her. I know she told me not to leave the garage, but I'm worried about her. She seems real upset. I wish I wasn't so mean all the time, but it's so hard. <laughs> My parents never loved me. Now Brittany hates me. I hate to see anyone upset. Sure, my mom's not really been the nicest person to me, but still, to see her upset, like, really breaks my heart. I wish I had friends. <laughs> I'm gonna go in there and tell her that it's all gonna be okay. Hey, uh, I heard you crying. Is everything okay? What are you doing here? I heard you crying, and it made me really sad. How much did you hear? Honestly, mom, I heard everything. And I'm really, really sorry. You're going through a lot right now, and I, I don't know, I just feel so bad for you. Well, I'm sorry for being so mean to you. Did I hear that correctly? You're sorry for being mean to me? I haven't had the best life. It's okay, mom. I forgive you. I know that being nice just isn't really your strong suit, but that's okay. You can definitely make a change. You forgive me? Of course I do. I know that deep down you're a good person. I mean, you took me in when no one else would. Do you know how many people ignored me when I asked them if they wanted to adopt me? A lot. And you were the first person to say that you would. I did do that. I guess I wasn't too mean. No, it was actually one of the nicest things that anyone's ever done in a while. And I really appreciate you, mom. Sure, I was really upset all the times you screamed and yelled at me, but it's okay. We can start new. Really? Yes, of course. I 
would love that. I promise, I'll try to be nicer. That's the first step, and I'm so excited. I've always wanted a real mom who loves me. Let's go sit on the couch together. <gasps> yes! And I, I have to ask you one more thing. Does this mean I don't have to sleep in the garage anymore? I hope she says yes. I hope she says yes. Yes, you can have your own room back. Yay! Oh my gosh. That's there are so many spiders in that garage, and I am telling you, whew, it's like a colony in there. All right, Mom, let's go watch TV together. I'm super, super excited. Well, it looks like things are gonna get better with me and my mom. I just had to be a little bit patient. Woo, I'm so excited!